Oh, will be heavy. A, amazing trophy. Congratulations again. I uh, mean, I don't need to be impressed with his level because I know that he's a super great player and it's so tough to beat him. And I knew this since the beginning and we played uh, before four times with each other. And with him, you can easily lose only the way he serves. As we could see today, he was serving unreal and uh, the way he shoots sometimes from baseline, uh, full power, so tough to to do something. And he have, like I said, he is moving really well, so it's not easy to hit a winner against him. So I was not surprised at all because I knew that's his level. I think so. I definitely think so. You know, it's a, it's a final of Master Series and uh, we both have match points in the tiebreaker. We're just battling, you know, we, we both have some chances. So definitely was just, yeah, just so exciting and just, uh, you know, super pumped at the end, you know, to, to, to battle and, and win that, uh, that, that last point. Andre, bad luck today, but um, what positives um, can you take out of the week overall, the tournament overall? The positive things I can take, the level that I was playing all this tournament, that I did one more final of 1000 Masters, which is not happening always. So those things I can take for sure as a positive thing uh, to keep basically working the same way because last month I felt that I'm doing everything right, I'm playing well, it's just a matter of time when I will be able to to show this game on the tournament and Shanghai was the first tournament when I was able to show this kind of level uh, on a tournament so hopefully I will keep only improving and keep showing this level uh, during the the rest of the season. Scooby. What was on your mind, uh, especially during the you know final couple of points facing match points, you know, in the tie break? What, what, what were you going through? Well, I just uh, you know just trying to you know the, uh, tell myself what what I was trying, what what to do during that uh, you know the points, uh, where to play, and uh, and you know you know to stay committed and you know to trust my shots and. Uh, you know, and, and just you know, just 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 fight and just battle. We we spoke yesterday and uh, about about your sort of your feisty nature, and you said it doesn't help you. Mm. You seem to be more actually more control today. I thought so today. Yeah, uh, there was only a couple of moments, but yeah, general. I think uh, I was able uh, to manage my emotions much better, and that's why I think I was able to to win the second set and uh, to have uh, chances in the third set because I think third set had good chances and there was just little details and Hubi, he sort of, all of them, pff, unreal. There was nothing to do. Seven, six. Second time Finish. he's done this in the tie break. Eight. Uh, the social media in China is talking about uh, how big effort you put into write a xie xie because we know it's a very hard character to write. Did Could I make it right or no? Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> very impressive. Uh, tell us uh, how uh, how do you practice it? How well, long? I just you? Uh, you know took a couple of hours, but uh, <laughs> now I just you know I just trying you know to memorize how to. You know how to how to write it, and uh, it's uh, it's not easy. And uh, by yeah, I mean it's uh, it's just really really you no, know, especially you know for us, it's a, it's a difficult language. So it's uh, yeah, it's just uh, wanted you know to, to to give thanks for for just amazing support that uh, I had throughout the the, the whole week, whole, almost two weeks here, and uh, yeah, and to, to to thank the Chinese fans. Match. I was just wondering if you could talk through how you manage the emotions of such a big occasion. I mean, I just, uh, you know, Andre was playing some really good tennis and I knew, you know, I, I got to produce the shots. So, so I was just trying to, you know, to stay out there and compete as hard as I could and, and you know, to keep positive self-talk and then keep the belief till the end. You know, at the end of the day, it's final and you want to just, just give it all, all you got out there. And you have a chance to to be qualified for the Turin Masters. Uh, so is it an expectation for you or? Well, I mean, you know, coming, uh, you know, to, to this 
couple of weeks, uh, you know, starting here in Shanghai, you know, I, I knew if I, you know, got to give myself a chance, I need to be winning tournaments. So, so you know, that was uh, that's pretty, pretty good start. I mean, this amazing week here in Shanghai, I really enjoyed it with the team, but ultimately we just, uh, yeah, we just want to get better every single day and then improve, you know, enjoy those moments. But, uh, yeah, you know, we're just, just going to try our best and then just keep, you know, keep fighting com and keep competing. Can you speak a little about your expectation for the, the end of the season? Go no expectation just to to keep practicing to keep doing every day as best as I can and uh, to try to qualify for Turin and then we'll see what's gonna happen I still have two more tournaments hopefully I don't know the goal yeah is to qualify to Turin so hopefully I will be able to show a great game in Vienna and Paris and we'll see if I will make it to Turin or not and if I will make it, then I have one more tournament.